Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I'll bring you guys some WWE 2K15 My Career on Next Gen. I'm going up against Sting and Bane's Love Child tonight. Now, I know you guys are going to love this match against Suze Tucker as I give him that nice little spin kick right there. Trying to get his face ready for this signature. You know, I'm going to try to break his jaw tonight. But uh, isn't it funny how this player model looks, man? Looks exactly like Sting. But has the body information of Bane. It looks like he's been doping for the last three months. It's insane. Look at how he just picked me up and just dropped me right there. No effort at all. He did that in his sleep. My jabs don't even phase him right now. He went straight through the jab. The sweep kick didn't even work if you guys would have noticed that. Man, this dude is crazy, but... Luckily, I'm getting a couple punches off. It's probably because I'm the quicker fighter. But he caught my leg right there in midair and slammed me right over. It wasn't nothing hard. Look at him stepping on my chest, man. Come on. What force it takes for a man to just step on your chest and take all the wind out of you. This is a nice little backbreaker right there. So, you know, I'm going to get up out of that real quick. Though I've been working on my little reversal game. And I hit him with a nice little leg sweep, you know, try to slow him down. Hit him with a big boot in the corner. His legs is still on the ropes. That's how you know it's real. <laughs> but I give him a jab. He's in the corner. Give him a couple hits in the corner, man. Try to soften him up. I told you guys, I'm going to get his chin ready. Look at that. Hit him right in the chin. And then I'm going to whip his ass out of here. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Now, I encourage this. I encourage taunting. Please taunt to get your signatures up. If you got this game and you're not taunting all game long, something is wrong with you. All right, the king encourages taunting. So please, by all means, guys, taunt all you want. But I give him another jab. This time I'm going to go with a in the corner grapple. Now, I know all you guys love my NBA 2K video, so I'm going to give him a little alley-oop right there, you know. Trying to get his head hurting real bad, you know, got his back aching. So, you know, let me back up real quick, wait for him to get up. Taunt a little bit more. Now, check this out. I go slow, move like the Matrix, but oh man, look at this headbutt. His headbutt literally lays me out. I couldn't even move for a moment, but I hit him with a nice little spin kick. Wait for him to try to get up. Give him a few elbows to the back, you know, nothing crazy. Now, he got his momentum up, and I'm just like, you know what? I don't know what to do right now, so I'm just following the buttons on the screen. And luckily, I reversed that hit with a clothesline of my own. Now we're talking. Now it's a match. But he still gets up. Hits me with a nice shot to the jaw. And look, I tried to reverse that shot, but it was so slow that I still got hit with it. It is insane. But, hey, it is what it is, guys. But check this out. I finally see it. I finally time it right. And I hit it with a nice clothesline as well. Now, I'm going to tell you guys, when you don't have a signature... It's just one of the worst feelings in the match because you know you know you can beat this guy. You know it's not much else that's needed to be done, but you have to wait for the finisher. So I kind of just take part in to see if I can actually pin him without the finisher, and he kicks out after one. Now, he still does have a little bit of health bar left. You know, his stamina is a little depleted, so, you know, I'm not really totally worried about that. I think the lion is about to come out, man. I know you guys see that tattoo on my back. So I'm just going to bait him in real quick, man. Get my finisher going. Try to get my signature rolling. Now, right here, I'm just waiting out. See if he comes to me. And yes, he does. I missed the leg sweep, but I still was able to get a shot off. Now, I'm going with the little signature right here. Little combination, you know. Get the punches rolling. Hold up. Watch my feet. Watch my feet. Watch my feet. Oh, yeah. Softening up the jaw, ladies and gentlemen. I feel a jawbreaker coming on. Oh, yeah. So I charge my finisher. My finisher is called Various Boxing Punches. So, you know, I hit him with a nice little jab. Stepping in my, to my jab. You guys see how strong it is. Watch my feet as I hit him with an uppercut. Oh, yeah. Make sure you like this video for that nice little uppercut. Ooh, y'all. He's on a mat. Time to pin him. Time to get this match over with. You already know what it is. One, two, three. Let's get it. And that's how you win a match by pinfall. That's how you put somebody on a ass. I make, I make wrestling look good because I'm coming at it from a boxing standpoint. I don't know. How do you guys feel about that? Do you think I should move my, I mean, switch up my move sets, you know, add more slams, uh, add more actual wrestling moves like whips and things of that nature, uh, you know, like uh, actual like open hand slapping 
fighters, stuff like that. You know, let me know. If anybody has WWE and you're in the comment section, please, by all means, leave some move sets inside of there. You know, I'll try to change things up, switch my guy up, see how things work. I'm even thinking about changing my uh, finisher. I think I'm going to keep my signature the same, you know, and then I'll be able to, you know, change it to a finisher. I'm thinking about Choke Slam right now, but who knows? But our pot King Carter wins another match yet again. And uh, this is IKC signing out. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed. Tell your friends, man. Make sure you subscribe. Peace, y'all. Yeah.